Next, let's talk about ponds. Ponds are usually shallow enough so that if the water is clear, sunlight can reach the bottom and plants can grow throughout all of the pond. Plant roots grow into the pond bottom and hold the soil, making the water even clearer and allowing more plants to grow at greater depths. This is important to the life of a pond because the plants produce much more than food. Being shallow allows a pond's water temperature to remain about the same everywhere in the pond. The pond's water temperature changes quickly as air temperature goes up or down. Dissolved oxygen in a pond can also change fast. Underwater life depends on oxygen in the water. The main sources of dissolved oxygen are surface air and photosynthesis by plants and algae in the water. Oxygen is dissolved in water when water mixes with the air at the water's surface. Waves and wind help mix air into the water. Water temperatures and even salinity can affect the amount of dissolved oxygen in water. Cold water can hold more dissolved oxygen than warm water. And fresh water holds more dissolved oxygen than salt water. Another source of oxygen is aquatic plants and phytoplankton. These organisms give off oxygen in the water as a byproduct of photosynthesis. A pond's oxygen levels can vary widely over the course of a day. This happens because during the day, air from the surface and oxygen from plants is constantly replenishing the dissolved oxygen that's consumed by animals and by aerobic decomposition of detritus and other decaying matter in the water and along the surface of the pond's bottom. Plants stop producing oxygen at night because photosynthesis requires sunlight. During the night, oxygen continues to be used by animals and by aerobic decomposition. This results in many ponds having higher dissolved oxygen levels in the day than at night.